Sean Brown, can you tell us a story, please? Once upon a time, long, long ago, long before there were people on the earth, there were creatures that ruled the planet. They were known as the dinosaurs. Where are they now? They are extinct. They are gone. They are here no more. What happened to the dinosaurs? Well, the scientists believe millions of years ago, one day a meteor or a large rock fell from the sky and crashed into the earth. When it collided with the earth, there was a big explosion that killed most of the dinosaurs. The scientists also believe that after the rock crashed into the earth, it created a very large cloud of dust. There was so much dust that it blocked the sun for months. Without sunlight, the plants died. So the dinosaurs that ate plants, they died. Then the carnivores, the meat eaters, the dinosaurs that ate other dinosaurs, they soon ran out of food and they died too. They all died and their bones were scattered all over the earth. Over the years, the earth shook with earthquakes and there were floods that swept the earth. The floods swept these bones through the valleys, into the riverbeds, and over the hills and the plains. Then, in the 1800s, the scientists, or dinosaurs, also called paleontologists. Can you say paleontologists? The paleontologists discovered these bones buried in the earth. These bones were covered with dirt and minerals from the water when the rivers and floods covered them. These bones were as hard as rock. They were called fossils. Can you say fossils? They found these bones one at a time, digging. Look, I found the foot bone. P-U. Over here, look. I found the ankle bone. Hey, look, I found the shin bone. Over here, I found the Barbie doll. What, how'd that get in there? Get that out of here. Look, I found the knee bone. After they found all the bones, they put them together one at a time. The foot bone connected to the ankle bone and the ankle bone connected to the shin bone and the shin bone connected to the knee bone. And slowly, they put the whole dinosaur together. There were two kinds of dinosaurs. Plant eaters and meat eaters. One of the plant eaters was called the Triceratops. Can you say Triceratops? They called him the Triceratops because he had three horns on his head to protect him from the meat eaters. Triceratops used their sharp beaks to snap off thick branches other dinosaurs couldn't eat. Another plant eater was the Stegosaurus. Can you say Stegosaurus? The Stegosaurus eats some of the shorter trees and ferns. When the Stegosaurus starts wagging his tail, that means there is danger nearby. He has some nasty spikes on his tail for any meat eater who thinks he wants a piece of him. Then there's the meat eating dinosaurs, carnivores, Tyrannosaurus Rex, also known as T-Rex, also known as the terrible lizard. He was the largest meat eater ever to walk the earth. His bulging eyes rotate forward, and he has the sharpest vision for finding food. He has a great sense of smell. Remember your five senses? With his nose, he can smell blood from 20 miles away. The T-Rex had very powerful jaws, and he could use his jaws to bite hard on his prey and shake them to death. Then with his three mighty claws on each foot, he would jump on another dinosaur and pin him down and start breaking him up into little pieces. Arf, 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 arf. 
lots of little pieces like like nuggets they were they were dinosaur nuggets <laughs> they were dinosaur nuggets <laughs> he would have some nuggets for later and sometimes he would save some food for the baby he had to save some nuggets for the baby t-rex look there's a baby t-rex now here, baby T, here, baby T. You go chick, go chick, go chick. Ow! He bit me! Boys and girls, never, ever put your finger in the mouth of a baby T-Rex. But he's so cute! Go in at a baby T! Go chick, go chick, go chick. Ow! Promise me, boys and girls, don't do it. Now, you know Sean Brown is just being silly. We all know dinosaurs are here no more. Dinosaurs are gone. That was fun. <laughs> Subscribe, share, act like you care. <laughs> Calm down, Sean Brown.